What is up guys? Silver Warrior here. In this video, got a late night silver unboxing for you. And the package did not come super late or anything. I just had something to do earlier and thus was not able to do a live unboxing until now. Well, I'm <laughs> pre-recorded, but you know, you get what I mean. Nevertheless, here we are, and I think we got a few cool things in here, so looking forward to opening this for you guys. Let's do that about the most dangerous way possible. But who cares, right? <sighs> as long as the silver's okay. <laughs> Alright, so... Let me make sure I'm getting everything out of here, because there's definitely a variety of stuff, which is something I'm always happy with, or happy about, rather. Okay, so it would appear that this, yep, all right, cool. So let's get everything sorted out. I don't believe anything is in here. Alright, so this should be about everything here. Not really certain, but I believe I do have everything out. Yeah, definitely a cool variety of stuff though, which is what I'm happy with. More than anything else, because generally I'm not really getting too much of a variety like this. Uh, I'm certainly not getting too much graded bullion, so that's cool to finally have some of that in the new stack. And there's a decent amount of it, so... And the whole reason that I got this stuff is because I won it all in auctions, so... I was able to get relatively good prices on it. And otherwise, I would not buy graded bullion, you know what I mean? I would not be paying full retail price for it just because I'm not that much of a fan to be honest enough to where I would pay it. I'm not saying there's anything wrong with doing so but that's just my preference. I'm not the biggest fan of graded bullion but when I can get a good price on it I'm not going to complain for sure for sure. So this is everything I got and it you just try to take everything out of the bags so you can get a better view but not anything too too crazy you know just some cool pickups. No gold, which is not ever really a great thing, but it is what it is. I mean, I am Silver Warrior after all, right? So this actually I thought was really cool. That's why I just had to buy it. Um, I've never really seen this before. But I definitely thought it was really interesting. And so there's just a decent amount. I'm trying to, I think it's $3 face value. Yeah, 15 times 2 is 30 and divided by 10 is $3 face value in a silver Roosevelt de Dimes. I just thought that was really cool because the book itself I've never really seen so I kind of had to, you know, jump on the opportunity to get something unique. But yeah. Uh, and then this five ounce bar I thought was really cool. I've never seen this particular bar before but I like these kinds for sure. Just, you know, more unique piece, I suppose. I really like the, uh, I think it's called a waffle bag. Correct me if I'm wrong. But yeah, Southeast Refining. Just a nice little five ounce bar. Uh, nice, uh, Morgan. Sorry, I was just having a, uh, brain fart there on the name. Yeah, nice Morgan dollar. MS63, not crazy good condition, but, you know, not a bad grade. I mean, there's nothing really that great about the date or anything. It just is what it is. I mean, but it's cool. Uh, this I thought was really nice to get to pick up. A uh, 2018 Libertad. Uh, yeah, I thought that was a nice pickup for sure. I did not take the wrapper off this one. My bad. I would do that right now. The 2014 uh, Britannia. These are a pretty decent coin, I believe. So happy about that for sure. 
2012 Koala. Again, pretty cool. Kind of just saying the same thing over and over again. Sorry for that. I don't really have too much of a interesting commentary, but and this is backwards. Uh, but yeah. Kookaburra. So, like I said, overall, pretty happy to be able to add some stuff to the stack. I believe this is it's 10 ounces in a uh, bullion. Oh, no, I'm, I'm really dumb. I was calling the Morgan Dollar bullion. Uh, no, 9 ounces in bullion. And then we have a Morgan Dollar and $3 face value in uh, dimes. So I'm not exactly sure what the weight is on that. I'm not going to sit here and lie to you. I really don't know, uh, to be perfectly honest. But a few more ounces of silver amongst that. So overall, not a bad unboxing for sure. And I got some more auction wins coming in. Some pretty unique stuff, I believe. I think it's just a few things. But they're all pretty interesting, so that's why I'm looking forward to it. And with that being said, I do hope you enjoyed the video. And that is it for this one. Peace.